there is in the hangar in the tower he's currently selling the season of the plunder armor set I'll show you guys how they look right now i think a lot of the pieces are really cool also interesting the fact that i've never seen zer sell this at least i don't remember so this is pretty cool very cool to have this under his inventory because i do know some people missed out on this armor and i do think a lot of the pieces are really cool starting from the hunter i think the helmet is pretty interesting definitely worth a pickup the arms are symmetrical so that is a really big plus i just don't like the the shape of the arms personally uh the chest piece i think the tool in the front really throws it off for me which is why i'm not the biggest fan of it and i think the boots are the best part and then the cloak is pretty trash for the warlocks i think the helmet is really cool i think the chest piece is really interesting and the bond is really cool with the glow other than that the other two pieces are really not worth talking about and for the titans i think the arms are like like one of the best pieces from the set just because it is asymmetrical but you do have a big ass bull on one side which is really cool and i've actually used the boots in a recent video that i'm currently working on which kind of surprised myself because i actually made it look really cool and the helmet i'm not the biggest fan of the just like it looks like it has an overbite and that's why i've never been a really big fan of it um i also don't like one eyes like cyclops cycloptic things i really not the biggest fan of that um and then the mark is okay i it's way too bulky but if you lean into it you can make some really cool sets and it's the chest piece has the same problem with the hunters where it's just a tools in the front which kind of makes me not like it so let me know what you guys are going to be picking up i definitely would recommend all of it just because you might never know when you might make something cool specifically like the titans i use the, the boots and i never use the boots but in that set i was like wow it looks really cool kind of like a mixture of like underwater Thor themed I guess you would say you guys will see once we have those videos out but <clears throat> as for the weapons we're going to be looking at whispering slab with quick draw demolitionist it's it's okay we have cold denial with feeding frenzy and swashbuckler which I actually would say this is worth a pickup just because ooh, with range mm, I would say this is worth a pickup just because swashbuckler is going to be nice you just have to melee to get the proc and then feeding frenzy it used to be really really good i mean it's still pretty good but not like back then uh we have extra extraordinary rendition with overflow and tap the trigger uh, i'm i definitely don't think this is worth a pickup the overflow is nice but if this was a rampage i would definitely say it's worth a pickup uh fractithis with full trigger system and <coughs> and thresh this is not worth a pickup just because we already have fully auto in the game intrinsically so this is just basically one perk path of least resistance stats for all and one for all i would say this is worth a pickup not only because the stat stats are pretty good but because if you didn't get this last season from wait not last season if you didn't get this from season of the seraph the, um then you'll definitely gonna want to pick this up because you can use your uh your uh oh, what's it called let me see hold on i always forget what the hell this thing is called this right here if you use your deep sight harmonizer on it you'll be able to get it uh which i would recommend because it's really good but uh, who's gal with auto loading and cluster bomb this is decent this is definitely decent i just uh don't like cluster bombs anymore i just don't think they do anything anymore uh night watch outlaw and multi-kill clip i feel like we see this almost every week now um range finder or not right range uh for the master rook is pretty nice small boar is also pretty nice although extended barrel is probably better yeah like it's not bad i just i feel like we see this gun come out like almost every week now as for the exotic we're gonna be hawk moon eye of the storm again i've really been liking eye of the storm but at the same time um that's probably just because the hand cannon that i have is just good overall dead man's tail with vorpal i definitely would pick this up just because uh, the cranial spikes plus hmm I don't know i think fourth times or like subsistence i think it is is just way better subsistence the one that you shoot like, when you kill stuff you get a bullet back that one cold heart will be <laughs> cold heart okay it's yeah it's cold heart if you don't have it uh definitely pick it up this is an og weapon like this is an old gun bro <clears throat> uh worm husk crown with uh Mm, i'm not the biggest fan of these stats i mean you will get a one on resilience and then a plus two on recovery technically if you masterwork this and you get the recovery a plus 10 because you'll have a 19 10 19 
and then that strength is wild but i never really like to put my chips into strength for a hunter just because i can get my melee back pretty easily with your uh, gambler's dodge and for me i think for wormhouse crown especially um i would forgo the recovery and just go with mobility and resilience just because uh wormhouse you can you can heal stronghold with really good stats unfortunately it's stronghold who's using this and wings of sacred dawn which and that mobility is pretty terrible so that's pretty much it let me know what you guys are going to be picking up i definitely think all of the armor sets are worth a pickup but if i had to choose like few pieces from each class i would probably say for the hunter i definitely think the boots and the arms and the helmet are worth a pickup for the warlocks helmet chest piece and bond is worth a pickup and then for the titans i definitely think the arms and the boots are worth a pickup and maybe the mark maybe see what i get actually so i am on my titan so let's moon marchers okay um with terrible rolls cool i never want you never like to see high mobility on titans or warlocks just because why would you don't worry about this this is for the uh <clears throat> the, the uh, taking king sets video which i am almost done with all of the armor i'm only missing the class items for the titan and the hunter um uh, warlock already has all the pieces thankfully um so i already have all the video like all of the sets made i just need to get the last pieces for the titan and hunter so that way i can actually make the review for it and then the shader video and then we'll get into the individual pieces this is one of them um you guys will see that in the video but this is usually a surprise or like a reward for those that um actually come up to this point in these videos so usually i have something like that in the end of these videos but let me know what you guys think what are you guys going to be picking up let me know in the comments below i appreciate you guys be safe i will see you all later